Big news coming out here at the Wing Stadium Complex, and figuratively and literally, it will be a spiked level of enthusiasm in the cube as USA Michigan Volleyball will call the complex home. To help us talk about that is Mike uh, Clark. Mike, let's talk about this announcement. You actually made the announcement to your members yesterday here at the, the complex. Today, it becomes a reality. Talk about the enthusiasm of calling uh, Wing Stadium home. Uh, Mike, thanks a lot. Uh, we're very excited about Wing Stadium and what the new possibilities of this move are for our organization. Uh, increased growth, increased visibility, and just a new place for our members to call home and, and train every week. Uh, there's still ice in the cube as of today, so we're doing this on the floor, on the, the blue uh, special events floor that will be in the cube. This will be the surface that you guys are playing on. Big enough for hockey, but it's also going to be big enough for five volleyball courts when it gets moved over to its new home. Yes, that's right. We're going to have five volleyball courts. Um, we'll have the blue sport court like we're, we see here today. There will also be a uh, plywood subfloor underneath to uh, make impact and jumping easier on the athletes. We're really excited. We think it's a great facility, and we can't wait to move in. You guys have been using a lot of different venues in southwest Michigan to call it home, to have one building, one venue, the size of what this is. What does that do as far as numbers here in the future? Well, it does a lot for us. Um, as you mentioned, we've been all over the map uh, for the last few years, and um, we've made it work. But to have one facility like this, it's really exciting. Um, our numbers from last year, we can more than double our numbers from last year. Um, when you look at that, and in particular on the travel side of things, uh, you're going to have a lot of travel teams uh, and girl teams as well as part of the travel. What are the levels of uh, teams that you're going to be seeing and that will be uh, competing here in the Cube? Uh, well, we're going to be able to offer the training for our travel teams, national, regional, and state levels, as well as our youth training camp programs for those 14U and below. We're also going to be having competitive and recreational adult leagues here um, with three opportunities to compete every week. Uh, so it, it allows us to break into the adult market a little bit where we haven't been in the past and uh, also provide our excellent training for our younger players as well. Well, the cool part of it is obviously the talented players you mentioned for the travel that have that are going to have that ability. For the girls that want to get their inner Misty May and maybe to date myself here a little bit, the guys that want to get their inner Karch Karai, they're going to be able to uh, do that as well as adult league is going to be here, novice as well as competitive. For those who are having uh, volleyball teams or maybe softball teams right now, very easy transition into softball here in the cube. Excellent. Yeah, that, that's right. Uh, a lot of people in the summer are outdoors doing stuff. Now it's, it's getting into the winter and fall, and it's time to come inside and, and play some volleyball. Uh, we're real excited about it. Um, like you said, adult, uh, competitive, and recreational, um, especially with the on-site facilities here for refreshments afterwards. It's, it's a great fit for the adults uh, here at the Cube. Now, for those that want to see if they can get their daughter into the travel teams, for those interested in playing uh, into the adult league uh, scenarios in the co-ed leagues, how do they go about doing it? What are the tryout dates, and how do they get more information about USA Michigan Volleyball? Uh, well, the first and easiest way is always to go onto our website, uh, www.americanathlete.com. Uh, that has all the registration and tryout information for all of our programs. Um, the specific tryout uh, dates for the, for the junior levels, uh, October 27th is going to be an informational meeting, a free clinic, and registration for our training camp. And again, that's for athletes 14U and below who just want to train. Um, the travel team evaluations will begin November 10th with an informational meeting and first evaluation here at the Cube. Uh, we're going to have two waves there. The first wave is going to be for athletes who are currently on a varsity team or anyone in grades 11 and 12. That's going to be at 1 p.m. Second wave at 4 p.m. for current non-varsity athletes or anyone in grade 10 or below. Uh, we'll follow that up with our second evaluation and equipment fitting that's going to take place on November 17th. Uh, wave 1, 12 p.m., again, varsity athletes and upperclassmen. And wave 2, 3 p.m., um, non-varsity and any athletes grade 10 and below. Mike, congratulations. Big announcement here today. We look forward to hearing more about uh, USA Michigan Volleyball here in the, the upcoming weeks, and congratulations on here. But at this time, we want to bring in one of the co-founders of uh, USA Michigan Volleyball. Rob Buck will be uh, joining us in here. And, Rob, 
from when this club started to now, did you ever think that you would be part of a facility that has a 5,100 in wing stadium and a chance now to play on five courts in a building that was built in 1997? It's, uh, it's beyond my wildest dreams right now. I think this is going to be something that's going to be so helpful for our program. Uh, we started USA Michigan, believe it or not, as just an idea in the basement of my house. And uh, we've had tremendous growth over the past 20 years. We've developed centers in Kalamazoo and Oakland County, Ingham County. Uh, we're coming back to the beginning stages, though, is that we're going to put most of our focus right here in Kalamazoo and the surrounding counties. So uh, getting a chance to come into a venue like Wings is really spectacular. Obviously, it's a one place to call it home, and it makes life a little easier. I got to assume scheduling may be the easiest part of this because when you're calling a few different places uh, home in the past, you may not know if you're coming or going. Now your athletes know it's under one roof. Right. Well, we've 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 put kids in elementary schools with tile floors and had to battle basketball and uh, you know field hockey practices. Uh, Every place we've been have been just really great to us. They've just, uh, it's like squeezing 10 pounds of sugar into a five pound bag. But I think with uh, a facility uh, like this, it, it, it's gonna, I'm not gonna lose as much hair, that's for sure. Because uh, it's all about location, and it's all about facilities. And from there you go to the great staff and getting the word out. And uh, that's one of the things we're most excited about working with the wing staff is that uh, we believe that they want us to succeed and, and that's really important for us. We know that there's a lot of novice volleyball players in this area but you guys have had a lot of success on the national level, state level as well as region. What does that say about the uh, the girls that play volleyball in this region? I think there's some of the best volleyball players in the country that come out of this area and uh, uh, I think our job is to get them to their next level, uh, to prepare them for that next level. And uh, what we're most excited about is tapping into uh, youth volleyball at the middle school and even at the elementary school level. I think that's going to be fun going into the future. Congratulations, as I told Mike. A big day for you guys. We look forward to the continued growth of USA Michigan Volleyball here in the years to come. Appreciate it. Thanks so much. Well, here from Wing Stadium, a very big day, and we know we have uh, volleyed a lot of information your way, so set your uh, computer to wingstadium.com. You click on today's press release. You can also go to uh, USA Michigan Volleyball for more information to see how you can get those dates, and, of course, right here on the YouTube channel as well as Facebook and Twitter for more up-to-date information on what's going on here at Wing Stadium.